All right, we are here at the NYDTL Bronx Open, and this is your first hardcore tournament. Your first tournament since Wimbledon. Yeah. Period. Uh, what have you been doing since then? That was a very big event for you. <laughs> uh, well, I went. I went for holidays. I was a little bit chilling because I had a lot of tennis there, you know. So I, I thought I, I deserved some rest and. Then I was with the physios and preparing myself for for America, yeah, for for this tournament and for U.S. Open. I mean, you probably could you have made the qualies in Cincinnati or yeah, in Toronto. Cool. You could have, yeah. But you just you just decided just just not do it precisely yeah. to get yeah, yeah, yeah. to recover from the big experience you had. Uh, no, we just decided to play play here and and the U.S. Open, yeah, to not not fly since it was then a little bit longer, you know, we, we didn't count it that well because there was like three weeks then, but. Yeah, yeah, it was, uh, we just decided to play. You saying maybe it's, maybe looking back it was a little bit too long a break? <laughs> uh, maybe. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's all right. You'll know for next year. Oh, sorry. You'll know for next yeah, year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because last year you during that period you were playing what like ITFs on clay or something like that. If, yeah, uh, it was in uh, in Czech actually I think mm -hmm. before before US Open I was playing in in my city and in Prague yeah. ITFs. Yeah. yeah. What has your effort at Wimbledon meant for your life practically. Obviously, you got a lot of prize money. You can maybe invest more in your career. What what difference is it going to make uh, with the way that you plan your career and go forward? Well, definitely, yeah, definitely, I can invest more to my team, to as I mentioned, to the physio work and whole team. Yeah, I mean, uh, it changed a lot. You know, people kind of kind of know about me now I would say so so it's nice and uh, I'm just keep it, it was just nice also for for my head you know to know I can I can do good on a uh, big stages so yeah it was, it was very nice there I mean this happened to you at what 22 today 23 now 23 yeah <laughs> it, that's not old but that's not having a big breakthrough at 17 yeah. so you spend five years fighting hard for that moment. I mean, a year ago at Wimbledon, I remember you you were like 200 in the world or something. Not Syria. Yeah, yeah, which is crazy. <sighs> and then you make semifinals. I mean, you were not you were not the 200th best player in the world. You yeah. were better than this. Yeah. So to prove to yourself that you are <laughs> is a big thing for your confidence. Yeah, definitely. I mean, I was struggling a little with my health, so I, I didn't play like concept, you know, week by week tournament. So I had to do, like rest a lot. So then I, I wasn't practicing, I went on a tournament, I didn't play much tournament through a year, so so I think it was kind of, then I, then I missed the experience from the tournament, and I think that was kind of the thing why why I was still around to 300, but since last year yeah, I started to, to play more consistent, more tourneys, even though I had this long break now, but yeah, definitely it helped my, my head and everything, and, and I'm, I'm happy where I am now. Well, the difference between this year and last year is that you can have a big Asian swing with the ranking that you have now. So maybe a rest in the middle of the season is a good idea. Yeah, I think I, I feel fresh, you know. <laughs> so so I'm looking forward. Uh, I will play in Asia some two, three tournaments. So I'm, I'm ready now, I think. You uh, you had a good run at the U.S. Open last year. Uh, maybe <laughs> if, if people didn't know of you before Wimbledon, but they might have remembered you from what you did here in New York yeah. last year. Uh, what... What are you expecting coming in there now, not having to qualify? Yeah, I think that's a big help that I don't I don't have to play three more rounds in a quali, and it's tough there, so you never know if you get through. And last year, I know I was missing some energy then in a <clears throat> when I played fifth fifth match, I think. So yeah, I mean, I will just try my best again. I, I really enjoyed it last year, and I like it there. I like like the stage there and everything. So I'm I'm looking forward. Great, and good luck for the rest of the week here. Thanks a lot, thank you.